Learning for the 21st Century is a project that involves uh, three schools in, um, in the Fort Vermillion School Division, Spirit of the North Community School, High Level Public School, and Upper Hay River School. This project, Learning for the 21st Century, focuses on increasing teacher capacity to engage students in meaningful learning activities. Our 21st Century project is integrating computers into the classroom using programs such as Blogster and KidBlog. I think if they feel more success um, with using the technology, we're going to have a greater um, percentage of students that are going to go from kindergarten all the way through to grade 12, and we're actually going to increase that, which is one of our division priorities is high school completion. The project is so important for the kids because it is it is the movement in our digital age. It's fun to be around technology because like it's the thing of the future, right? So you might as well involve it in schools and stuff. It's important that we learn these things because we are getting the 21st century. Things are focusing more on technology now. It's important that we learn how to use these tools because later on in life, they're going to be pretty much with us every day. We use computers and laptops in some of our classes. They're really great to use. And we can post comments and ideas on a blog that a teacher creates. Last year, we used a, a story and the students posted their story online and they were so excited because we opened it up to the division as well as a whole bunch of my teaching friends from down south and the kids were just amazed like, this is like facebook we put stuff on there and you know they they get to post back and it's people all over the world in terms of us being from the north it's allowed the world um, to be a little bigger for them because there are students from within our school division who have never gone out of this town if we have students that are more engaged more on task wanting to come here because it's more interactive uh, it's more aligned with their life. They're on Facebook, they're using iPhones, they're using laptops, they're using iPads at home. So we don't want them to have to power down when they come to school. We want them to be able to use those tools in an effective way. Last week I made a kid blog page. They had to write me a paragraph. They were motivated, they were engaged. Not once did I catch a student off task. They were diligently writing, responding to each other in an appropriate way knowing that these students have struggled in the past, have been reluctant learners, have not been as successful, and here they are posting and participating in the learning activity at the same intensity, I suppose. Their engagement would be the same as every other student. We've almost stood on our heads as educators to try to get these kids to be involved. This naturally um, allows them to be involved. The blogs and wikis that we were involved in were real fun because like, one of our classmates would like write something down and then from there like the whole class would like see it and then see if they like it or not and it's usually a positive comment. Some of the biggest challenges of this project are that all, not all teachers are comfortable with using the technology. We've had it here for two years and for some of us it means a big change in the way that we teach. As we're becoming more familiar with the technology I'm finding myself more focused and confident in utilizing it in the classroom. As soon as you become more comfortable, it's, you start integrating it more with your curriculum. We certainly want to build capacity in our teachers in utilizing 21st century learning skills. Uh, we would like to see more students reading, uh, reading at or above grade level. Most of my kids read about two to three grade levels below, so we're really working on trying to boost that. You know, students don't enjoy writing and they, you know, it, it's harder for them, but yet if they're on the computer, I still get a full story with amazing detail, great sentences. That's excellent and it really builds their confidence in their abilities. We have found um, over the two years our attendance rate at our school is better. Some kids, you know, they come only like once a week or something like that. Now they come like four days at a time sometimes. It's really good because usually they come for the laptops, but they also learn, you know. I think it definitely helps with attendance. Kids enjoy dealing things that are interactive, more fun. It's just sort of the way we work. Within five years, I would like to see more technology in schools being used effectively with students to support and enhance their learning.